Hey guys, what's going on? I hope you're all doing well. Today's gonna be a quick video on the Fluval Flex right there. We're gonna be talking about the new fish that I got for that tank and also make sure you stay till the end because I have two things that I want to tell you guys and if you're new here make sure you hit that red subscribe button below so that you don't miss anything. Let's get straight into this video. So this right here is my 15 gallon Fluval Flex tank and I've had it for the last one year and so far it's been doing so well for me and if you look closely you can see that I've got some new fish and the red fish are actually cherry barbs that I got um, just a few days ago. I have a short clip of me getting them. I'll play that right now. So as you guys just saw the cherry barbs at my local fish store, they didn't look so red and I think that's because of the blue color backgrounds in most of the tanks probably washed away some of the colors but as soon as they got into my tank the colors just just popped and they're super red now and I'm so happy that I got these fish because they're such great tank mates for my black phantom tetras and they're so peaceful and really really fun to watch especially when they eat their pellets that I feed them. I'll show you some clips of them eating later. It's really enjoyable. Also one thing is that in Singapore, where I'm staying right now, Singapore, um, what I've been told is that the suppliers of these fish, they don't like to sell the females away because then they're afraid people like me will start breeding them and selling them online because Singapore is such a small country um, they're probably afraid that they wouldn't be able to sell them to the fish stores anymore if they if people started breeding them but I've been told the same thing about killifish but I'm not so sure if it's true if you guys know anything about this just drop it down in the comments below so I can learn a bit more but um, I'm happy to get males because I'm not looking to breed them and the males are actually the brighter colored ones so um, I'm happy with that but let's let's continue with this video so right now I'm just gonna feed them some of this fish pellet that I got from my local fish store it's called ultra fresh I'm not so sure what all that says but um, this is what I got for them so I'll just try to feed them without dropping it all over the place all right that's probably enough you can see they'll go nuts for this thing. So thank you for watching until this point and now I want to tell you the first of two things that is happening, well, it, this one already happened, and what happened is that the bird that we saw just two videos ago has finally left. You can see its nest right here, and the flower pot that it has um, grew its, raised its babies in. It has left, and hopefully we'll see it come back soon. I hope it comes back soon. It should, because it has been coming back every few months to... Um, lay its eggs here and raise its young so if it does I'll let you guys know and now for the second thing you see this tank right here we're gonna be getting some new fish <laughs> 